Hi everyone, I'm Changi and behind the camera is Mr. Ozzy behind the camera. Right, today we're up here and we're on the table lifts. The table lift, for all of you who don't know, this is the very top of the house. If you look down there, there is a ladder. And the loading bay is around the other side. I would like, I would like you to tell me or to post in the comment section your section of method statement that shows how to load a, a, a table lift. Because for all the years I've been doing brick lane, I ain't seen one yet. And I'm sure it doesn't say, open the gate and climb up the ladder with materials. So that's for you, Miss. Let's have a look at your method statement. Um, that'd be a good start. That's a good start to my week anyway. Anyway, later on, it's give rain again, but the only upside is, it's the England match. Go on, the boys. <laughs> I'll be seeing you in the pub. Um, and I've got the kids full strips. One's the away kit for my daughter. One's the home kit for the lad. Right, same setup again. Brick underneath each end, cut to 74 mil. Because you've got a, well, a little bit less because these, the line's a couple of mil sitting on top, which I've uh, realised that it climbs a little bit. So, Ozzy's on the spreading again. Uh, I'm going to be laying the bricks and he's going to try and get a couple back towards me if he can, but because it's only a very short run, he may struggle to touch up here. So it may end up that Ozzy spreads and then just ends up coming back to the other end just about here so as I can just wake up and he comes off me. Uh, but he is going to be busy getting compo up and down that ladder that we don't carry stuff up. Okay? Yeah, exactly. But anyone else out there, any of you brickies or whatever, if you own your own company and whatever, and you want to send a little link to your method statement of how to load a table lift, it'd be much really appreciated because I'm not sure I know how to do it after 20 years. <laughs> not on paper anyway. The rain's coming in at nine. We might get a little bit done. We've got mortar on the boards. We're going to get some done. Enjoy this. <laughs> On that brick. That's free, that is. Oh, nice. Oh. Let's have a moan. No, I'm not going to moan yet. I'll tell you a story. I was walking the dogs on Friday when it was raining, and uh, one of my dogs is a Vizsla, Hungarian Vizsla, a sporting dog. And he decided that as we were walking down the canal, the canal has got the bank sides on it and they're probably about that deep for the actual water. He'd seen a bird fly across the water and he was deciding that he was going to go for a little swim. So it jumped in the canal and couldn't get back out. So I grabbed her by the scruff of her collar and said, You stupid dog! And I pulled her out and uh, that's the hero. Anyway, check these boys out, the labour hasn't turned in. And that's what bricklayers do when they're. Uh, Labour doesn't turn in. <laughs> Watch uh, YouTube videos. <laughs> so we're nearly at the top of this section anyway now. The line will become obsolete in a minute and we'll uh, rather than use a line I'll just go down to my four foot level. Use that. Right. Probably when we get yeah when we get to here. Just take the line off and it's easier just do it with the level there. You getting me? I know what you mean, Jelly Bean. Okay. Yeah, sweet Yeah. Right. So what I like doing now is flick the line up. Yeah. yeah, with the clip. Just hold it in. Oh whoa! Look at that. Hey. Oh that is that is a thing of beauty, isn't it that? Lovely that. Honest to God. You know when you walk on a scaffold and you see one of them? Gives you these little feelings, butterflies, and then, oh man. Oh yeah. Thank God. Can't wait so, to split my shin in two. I'm so glad they left me that. Like what? These guys. Well, to be fair, there's no scaffolders in today so far. They probably thought England match, no one will be in. But it certainly isn't the same feeling as uh, when the World Cup's in summer, let's put it that way. And when the World Cup is in summer. There ain't no man on site. Well, actually, I guarantee how many people we got on site can you see here now? We've got two over there, 
three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, eight, and then you've got half of one of them gangs eight, then. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. I can see, I can see like about 16 people now, right? 17, 18, including us. Tomorrow, look across this site. I guarantee you won't see four. <laughs> Last year, there was one man on the site, <laughs> and he must be a loser. <laughs> one oh, man yes. after, after the England game. First, first day we turned up uh, last year on site, Sean had been fighting in his local bloody kids centre. <laughs> and that ain't, to, that ain't to lie either. <laughs> oh no. Bit somebody's, what did he do? Bite somebody's finger or some sort of face or I don't know what he did. Uh, yeah, I remember you telling me. Yeah, that. what a, what a nut job. So if anyone's looking for the culprit, they know now, it's Sean. If someone's lost in it, eh? Yeah, pin old Tim's grasped him in. Uh, and then the other side. But yeah, you watch tomorrow. I'll only be, I'll be a soul here. Especially with it being a lunchtime kickoff. Can you imagine the amount of ale that's going to get sunk? <laughs> oh, mate. Hey, I keep... had four pints of Guinness last night just watching the game. The opening game. Qatar Ecuador. Yeah, Qatar Ecuador. Any any excuse into it, World Cup. Yeah. World Cup's on like, oh I've got me the pub duck. I've been doing a great job of keeping this cavity clean. Oh, what can I say? <laughs> what can you say? See the, oh, yes. Yes. He doesn't do it's, it it's not to slow, us but... Right. Chop that in there like that. That's See that? Good. It's on the corner. Oh. And then we're over it. The line down on it. Ah, boom. There we go. Line sorted there. Now he's ready to start going again. That's as easy as it is. Well easy. Brick by him. Yeah, yeah. This little bit will be done soon, so move on. And then we're off out. Room to build our dioramas. I always say. Yeah, well, like I say, scaffolding on the other side. We've got two little pediments we could build, I suppose. Oh, yeah. How many tons of mortar left, look? Check that out. Ah, uh, yes. One. <laughs> Free shovel, though. One, one tip between three gangs. So that's always good. One tub of mortar between three. And in fact, we've got two. Have we got one on the bay? Uh, yes, we've got one, one in a bit. Yeah. Well, we've got enough for what we need then. Yeah. So the next batch gets to the last thing. We'll do this and we'll be off, are we? Yeah. Uh, promised rain. Yeah, so rain's doing well holding off at the moment, but. Skyline. That's the North Staff Royal Stoke Hospital down there. There we are. Zoom in on that, mother. Look at the wind. Oh, yeah. You can see that we've oh, got it's the, a little wind sock there. Yeah, a little it? wind sock, baby. Half price that way. Huh? Half price, lad. Doing half price. Half price, I'll do half of me, Sam. Come on. Watch the YouTube video. That's it. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, you can always uh, 75 million. Oh, yes. Well, I don't really need to. But eyes, you know. He's got eyes, he has. Cold today, though, isn't it? Four there degrees. Is a good, uh, that was it, yeah, four degrees. I've got three layers on. I've got shorts on the mud. Look at that. <laughs> 
me see. Shorts on this guy. Got some major leg hair. It's the insulation. Got that much leg hair, he doesn't need to bother with the... In the summer I just come in my undercrackers. Do you? I do the same in mine. <laughs> <laughs> you do it again. Why would you do that? You don't use tissue now. Oh. You said it. In the summer. I, I mean on site. <laughs> you come in your undercrackers on site. In the corner of that plot over there. Yeah. Ah, you're funky man. Look. Oh, it is nice and easy, isn't it? That? It is lovely. That. Our she brick. Is. Clip off. The chip off the old block. There we Lovely. go. Storage there. I think they got the general gist now, don't they? Got the gist. Schindler's list. The general. <laughs> the genitalia. Ah, oh, yes. That's the end. That's the end of the line for Changi. Oh. Right, that's that one done. We've covered up with a bit of what's it over the top. The rain's starting to come down. It's not great. Not great at all. Uh, we've been down and done one of the pediments. I'll show you. But our mate, the joiners, have left us load of crap. Yeah. Done that one as well. Built up over that. But we're off. Yeah, look, I'll show you what the joiners leave you. They put these in here. But what they leave you is all this. Where they broke out brickwork. Uh, just because it doesn't suit them and then you've got no way of getting it out because you got you can't knock down because I put that in so well done they've done that both sides for us brilliant right everyone we've got some news this drop is finally done two pediments at the front are done and the two gables on the ends are complete all socked up fire socks are in so that and we've cleaned around the scaffold that's done now um, there's been a revelation on the job they're stopping house building on this job so if you have a look over here I'll come show you going around the corner all down there they're still digging footings they're still building footings but all the superstructure is stopping. They've told us that virtually, if we want, we can go and build the first lift on that house, is that pair down there. But other than that, that's it for us. There's no more work. And they've also said that all these houses across here, all these houses behind me, once they're complete, that is it. There's no more being built. And it's, uh, I think it's down largely to Liz Trust, the, she messed things up, but these houses aren't selling, I think. And they're not selling, so they can't build them. And it's mainly probably because they're about 100 grand too dear, each one, they're asking too much for them. But uh, we're, we're, that's it, we're, we're done on here. There's no more coming back. The other gangs have took all the work and we're left high and dry, as somebody actually said that we would be. So, what can you do? We're after a new start, so if there's anyone out there, <laughs> actually, we might have something in the pipeline, so we're not too dismayed. We'll either do that first lift, or we'll get a skier and we'll be gone. See you later. Um, but I think that'll be it. We won't come back on here, will we? There won't be anything for us. One of these bigger gangs will take all the weight now. Are you bothered? <laughs> 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 I'll find us some work. We'll get some. We could send try and nip mortar on him, put it in his pockets. <laughs> Good old Pat. 
<laughs> right, if you enjoyed today's video, give us a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. And who knows what the future holds. So keep watching the videos. Auf Wiedersehen.